There is something about a good rom-com that lifts the clouds of worries and takes you on a roller coaster ride. With Ticket to Paradise, Hollywood superstars George Clooney and Julia Roberts came together for their fifth film. Picturesque locations, finding love in unexpected ways, divorced parents, intergenerational differences, and self-discovery, all of this makes for a perfect recipe for a true rom-com. With George and Julia at the center, this journey promises a lot of excitement. David, George Clooney and Georgia, Julia Roberts have been divorced for many years. However, when their newly graduated daughter Lily Caitlin Denver announces marriage to seaweed farmer Gade, Maxine Butia, the couple is forced to communicate. David and Georgia decide to sabotage the wedding to protect their daughter from this unexpected marriage and the aftermath they experienced in their marriage. Will new generation love help this divorced couple find their way back to each other? Ticket to Paradise is as cliche as a rom-com can get. But it is the journey that makes the experience sweeter than the destination. The traditional rom-com elements peppered with new age romance makes Ticket to Paradise an endearing and lovely watch. The screenplay doesn't get too heavy at any point and is laced with situation humor which works. The wit, the charm is enough to promise an escapade you hoped for. For any rom-com to work, it is important for their story to connect. In the case of David and George, there is enough for the audience to ponder and root for them. George and Julia are beautiful on screen. Their charm is irresistible, and it is a bonus to see them exude that chemistry as they age like fine wine, on screen. Their off-screen friendship reflects in their on-screen camaraderie. Their bickering scenes are hilarious. Maxime and Kathleen are effortless as well. As two young people in Lao, the duo holds your attention and thoughts every time you witness them in an affectionate moment on screen. While Ticket to Paradise is made for a generation who has forgotten the traditional, sometimes illogical rom-com era, it is not flawless. It has its share of flaws. Be it George managing to get away with spite here with not even an inch of frizzle despite being in a supposed Bali forest, or the cinematography which overcompensates for relocating and shooting Bali-related sequences in Australia. The filmmakers pick local music to add an authentic flavor to this escapade. The length of the film works in its favor. Ticket to Paradise is your reminder that George and Julia in a rom-com can hardly disappoint.